Fuller and good morning everybody. Welcome back to a new video. So we are here in the beautiful Fiji. We have been here for the last four days in the most amazing island called Beachcoma. We have literally done snorkeling, kayaking, swimming, drinking. It has been the best time ever, but sadly it is time to say goodbye to Beachcoma today. We are going to be heading back to Nandi, the main island, where we're going to check out a few cool things. It's like a temple, a really cool like Fijian market, and apparently some like traditional mud pools. Uh, the guy on the way here in the taxi was like, you haven't been to Fiji if you don't do the mud pools. We've got a big day ahead, so let's go. guys so we had a really long boat journey it actually ended up taking about an hour and a half and it was like an absolute sweat box in there it was so so hot we just quickly grabbed a taxi and we're checking into our hotel we're staying in a place called club fiji just for one night but we've got some exciting things planned this afternoon we're going to try and go to the temple and these mud pools that i've heard amazing things about but first we just need to eat because i'm so hungry people are the most kindest people I've met in my whole entire life honestly every single Fiji thank you, is, thank you, thank you. that was since we arrived in here there's not one Fijian that didn't smile to us you know yeah everyone was yeah. looking and smiling and blind yeah. that's what, what can friend, I do to help that's in my that's is in our culture yeah. that's in our culture business or anyone we have to greet them from our heart not from the mouth of your lips from the heart we have to come the feelings Aww. you know yeah. that's why we all say we are Fijian people yeah. all righty guys so we have just arrived here at the mud pools it is so loud right now we're just like kind of in this tropical rainstorm. I am absolutely soaked, but we're just here. So it was 30 Fijian dollars to get in. It looks so cool. It's basically just like the shack in the middle of like this ground. And basically he was telling us in the car, we've got the coolest taxi driver. He's basically saying that this is all volcanic mud. It's really, really good for your skin. It has a lot of rich minerals, but we are in the middle of an absolute rainstorm right now. It's insane. Just like a cream, a lotion you put on your body. Eh? So this is what you Put it in your face or on your body. Eh? Make it black skin, eh? <laughs> this, is, brown. this is the color I wanted to leave Fiji, <laughs> eh? Fiji, Fiji color. Fiji color, yes. 
Fiji time, Fiji, Fiji colour. So the mud pool that we just came from, it was super weird because it was super squidgy. Like the mud, you like stepped into it and then your foot like fell. But it was like this deep was probably up to like just below my knee. It was real, it was like a real weird feeling. At the first, Anna was like, woohoo! Like it was just real weird. And then, yeah, we just like washed all the mud off. And then we've come into this hot spring here. And it is so, so warm. And you can tell because you're just surrounded by like all these volcanic things. It just looks really beautiful. So nice. I love it. Look at I love it. I mean, it's very warm, you know, very, very warm. And I feel like because our bodies are so sunburned, the first thing when we go in, I'm like, oh my God, can I go in or not? But no, it's amazing. And the contrast between the rain and the hot, it's just so like, so I'm loving so it. Cool. Um, we just made a little joke, so I don't know if you can see this, this finger here. So but I have a ring on this finger, but I had to take it off for the mud pools. So this was the colour I left New Zealand, and then this is Fiji colour. So I'm leaving as Fiji colour, nice and brown. Give us a little, sh a lo little look of your shoulder, babes. This is what you call Fijian colour. No, that's called burnt. Ooh, <laughs> that's called burnt. Burnt to a crisp. <laughs> Do you reckon this one is hotter than the other one or the other way around? I know I feel like this one's hotter, much hotter. Why is it green I would like to know though? Uh, that's a good question, probably some more mud. Ah. All right guys, so we just hop off our, off our last hot poo and I've got to say I can feel my skin's smooth already, you know? We have that Fijian glow. Ooh. But no jokes, like we did had a little bit of sunburn during the trip, so I guess all this hydration and minerals, it was really good. So let's try to get back on the car, back on the road and trying to explore as much as we can today. After the mud pools, we then made our way to a traditional Fijian village. Before entering, you will need to cover your legs with a sarong, and there's also a $5 entry fee per person. This goes straight back to the local village. Once you're all sorted, one of the local ladies will show you around. It's a real community inside, and everyone is so happy and friendly. This is definitely worth a visit if you're in Nadi to see how the local people live. So we just finished at the traditional Fijian village. It was actually really, really cool to like look around. I always like to see like how the local people live and see like the housing and just like their kind of way of life. 
it was really 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 interesting so it was five fijian dollars to get in and this lovely lady took us around for a wee tour around the village it's just really really eye-opening and at the end you would have seen like all of these tables so the ladies like set up all of their tables with all of their homemade crafts there now each table represents like what family made each thing so it's really hard to choose at the end because you should like buy something just to help like the locals um, so when you're choosing from the table it's really hard to choose what family you're going to give the money to I wanted to buy from everybody but it was extremely hard but I bought a really really cool bracelet it's like a black and white one and then I also bought a beautiful sarong as well but guys that is the end of this video don't forget to comment like and subscribe as always and I'll see you in the next one bye